tutorial on how to add your wallet to MySys browser so if you ever need to use MySys browser for any airdrop to connect your wallet you'll be able to do so so here is the step first of all head over to your wallet and then what you have to do is to click on the three dotted lines once you click on the three dotted lines click on show private key once you click on show private key you would have to enter your password to continue after entering your password to continue then you would have to hold to review the private key until it finishes loading before seeing your private key and then copying it to clipboard the second step is to search for mysys browser and download the app click on open this is what you see as your browser but you if you were to click on extensions you probably won't see different extensions so what you have to do is to click on extensions once you click on extensions you'll be able to see the amount of extension that you have but if you do not see it once you click there you might not see the icon click on the tree that is at the top right then scroll and look for extensions once you click there it still takes you to the same place now what you have to do is to click on discover more extensions and themes on the web store once you click there it takes you to the chrome web store where well, what you have to do is to search for metamask so once you search for metamask you see the results you click on the metamask and historian wallet in your browser it is already installed but you need to click on add to chrome it will show blue just like here but not remove from chrome once you click on that it is going to take some time and once it's done if you click on extensions you'll be able to see it over here but if you also click on extensions over here you can also see it after that is done what you need to do you need to import the private key so what you have to do is to click on the account once you click on the account you would need to scroll down once you scroll down you would see add an account at the bottom once you click there the next step is to import account so click on import account and then enter your private key string there after that click on the import button also note that this should be set to private key and not json file unless you're importing with a json file as you can see it has been successfully imported the wallet address you can see it and once it is here you'll be able to connect your wallet you'll be able to connect your wallet to any airdrop that you need to or any project that you're trying to do using the mysys browser just by clicking metamask and you can add as many as you want to here when needed hope this was able to help and do not forget to subscribe to the channel goal is 1000 subscribers make sure to turn on the notification bell like the video and ask any questions or feedback in the comment section till then